Backbreaker's unique down-on-the-field camera gets you right into the action on defense. Your skills matter, so let's take a look at how to use them. You move with the left stick and perform actions with the right stick. Before the snap, position your player using the left stick. Move the right stick left and right to orient yourself and look around. Playing D in Backbreaker is all about playing a role and playing it well. You can pre-select your position prior to the snap. Once you've picked out your target, it's time to bring the pain. To perform a wrap tackle, simply position yourself into the path of your victim. Gets the job done, and sometimes that's all you need. However, for more control, use the right stick for user tackles. Flicking the right stick up will perform a dive tackle, great at longer distances and when chasing the ball carrier. Flicking the right stick down will perform a barge tackle. Get the timing right on this one, and it will stop your target dead in their tracks. By default, your player will move in zoning mode, always facing upfield. For extra speed and momentum, or to quickly chase a receiver, pull the right trigger to enter aggressive mode. You will now run faster, and any tackle will have an even larger impact. But you need to be accurate. Veer off target, and you'll miss. Understanding D-line interaction and blocking in Backbreaker is key to deploying a lethal defense. To defeat a block, flick the right stick to rip left or right. A circular gesture on the right stick performs a spin move. And Passing in football is all about focus. You need to read the play as it unfolds and hit the receiver with maximum precision. Backbreaker uses a simple and powerful control scheme for passing. You move your quarterback with the left stick, and you pass the ball with the right stick. First things first, flick the right stick up to make a quick bullet pass. Or move the right stick down and up to loft the ball over the defense. To scan the field and switch receivers, simply hold the right stick left or right. The currently targeted receiver is highlighted red. If you prefer, all highlights can be switched off. You need to read the action on the field to maximize your chances. Throw into double coverage and the interception risk rises. Throw before your receiver reaches his mark and you'll likely make an incomplete pass. For further control, you can lead receivers by adding a little aftertouch on the right stick immediately after the pass. This will make sure the ball reaches the receiver in open space, but don't overdo it or that ball is going to be picked off. Perfect passing takes concentration. Hold the left trigger to zone in on the targeted receiver for a precision pass. You will now throw with maximum accuracy, but you'll be less aware of what's going on around you. In focus mode, flick the right stick left and right to quickly switch receivers while staying zoned in. But be careful! You really don't want to miss that blitz now. The running game in Backbreaker is the bedrock of your offense. Because Backbreaker's action is euphoria-based, it pays to learn how to use physical momentum to your advantage. Knowing when to stay agile and when to really go for it is key to gaining yards. You move with the left stick and perform special actions like juking or stiff-arming with the right stick. Let's start with Agile Mode, the default mode in Backbreaker's running game. Flick left or right on the right stick to perform a juke move. A quick circular movement will launch a spin move. This nicely throws your opponents off. Flicking the right stick up performs a hurdle. And if you find yourself in one of those fourth and goal moments, why not go for it with a high-flying dive? Just hold the right stick up and your player will attempt to clear the line of scrimmage in front of him. 
Now to the other side of the running game. To enter aggressive mode, hold the right trigger. Your right stick now performs power moves. Moving the right stick left or right lets you stiff arm your opponents. Because Backbreaker's action is physics based, you'll need to get your timing and positioning right. To charge through players in front of you, hold the right stick up to perform a shoulder barge. This aggressive move should help you smash through the line and pick up valuable yards. Again, the action is physics based, so take into account the number of defensive players you're facing. And finally, hold the right trigger to scramble as the quarterback. Easy! How you avoid that linebacker coming straight at you? Well, that's up to you.